see. You can dedicate like your whole fucking life to something, right? Like I probably do with this music shit, or somebody would say, and and you can completely go unheard almost sometimes, like people. You know when I was count three, I didn't let go of it, lost. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Good morning and welcome to today's video. Welcome to the first leg, Project USA. Bikes are packed, they weigh a ton, and uh, we've ridden about an hour just to get used to them before starting the video. You've been riding on the wrong side of the road constantly. <laughs> we found a hillbilly. You nearly fell off. Oh, yeah. by a hillbilly, you remember? I won't, <laughs> oh, yeah. I won't kill you. Uh, first mission of the day, we're going to try and find a diner um, for some breakfast because our hotel uh, didn't do anything. But it did have damp. <laughs> Oi Lawrence, you know why I know this is a good place? Why? <laughs> American flag, innit? Flag? So some random dudes found us in the street. Yeah man, they were nice. Nice guys. Yeah, they were good guys. Recommended this place. There's a whale on a piece of paper. Actually an orca. I feel like we should have gone to a diner. I'm being confused as to why there's fruit and savoury stuff on one plate again. No, I think it's quite nice because <clears throat> It's like the main and the pudding, but together. Right, we've just stopped at Pacific Coast Cycles. Get a Torx key for Lawrence, because his saddle has been slipping. Um, my saddle's been a little bit too far back, so we changed that as well. Yeah, sorry, stem's too long, bar's too long. I mean, the frame's too long. But something that people never, okay, so Bike for Tuesdays in California. <laughs> something that nobody ever takes into consideration is the reach of a handlebar. Yeah, you can yeah, increase yeah. the reach of a bicycle. When I say reach, I'm talking about from the back of the control to the saddle which is effectively what, how the human being interacts with it. You can increase that amount, but that distance, by up to 30 or 40 mil, just by changing the handlebar. So you get these people and they're riding around and they've got piddly little stems on them, on their, on their bikes. But, but they could actually, be wrapping their bars if different. They, if, they, if, they, if the bar's badly set up or it's a particular handlebar that is longer in the reach, so, I mean, to give you some ideas of lot, lot bars that are longer in the reach, a lot, most of the three T's are quite long, uh, zip's relatively long. All the handlebars that come on the treks are generally really long in the reach. I mean, I tend to sell quite a lot of Pro, which is specialized component arm, or Data Elementi, both short. of which, because they are super short in the reach, which means that you can then get a longer stem, comparatively to achieve the same amount of reach. Which, I mean, let's face it, that's what everybody wants, isn't it, at the end of the day? Everyone well, it's a balancing act. I suppose some bikes yeah, have a totally. too short stem on. And then yeah. you, the handling's too twitchy, well, so you my, want to go down. My nice way. bike's got a um, got a long reach bar on it with a slightly shorter stem, and you know it's lovely. Oh, they've, they've lent you a torch key. This is a normal, um, sensible seat pack. You know, you got water, you got emergency supplies, you got a light on it. This is Lawrence's. Ready? Snacks, <laughs> <laughs> cookies, Velo Fortes, and a blankie. <laughs> it's not a blankie. So we're now nearly forty miles in. The first ten miles took us about an hour. Um, but now all of the climbing the is done. You'd be surprised how long it takes to uh, climb anything when you've got a bike laden with so much stuff. It completely knackers you out and you can't really get out of the saddle properly. It's a, you can't throw the bike around. I think we've got a stonking tailwind for the rest of the ride. The last um, 20 miles or so have been good. You've had right. this much to drink all day. Yeah. You've done two bottles. And you've had that, all of everything that you've brought, you've had everything. Yeah, you've got a drink, man. Brother, how's it going, boys? Yeah, good, man. This is quite a wide bike lane. This is an amazing bike lane. This is how it should be. Oh, totally. So we're basically one straight road all the way to LA now. This is the Pacific Highway uh, from San Diego to Los Angeles. We're going to spend the night in Huntington Beach. Uh, we've got a few people we're going to meet up with, haven't we? Uh, and yeah, we're going to have a few drinks. But we're going to have a party tonight, I think. This is the only time we can actually party because the day after that, uh, I got a bike fit and then the day after that, it's it's it's, it's gonna go start. Time. It's go time. It's gonna start getting hard. Three Mojave legs. So Los Angeles to Baker, Baker to Barstow, Barstow to Las Vegas. 650 k's, three days, all through the desert. Yeehaw! Badass. Badass, dude. All right. That was fun, wasn't it? Yeah, we just did like 50k an hour for like six miles. On the freeway. On the freeway, or faster even. So we just got to um, the army base, the Pendleton base. Got to the border, and apparently because we've got British passports, they couldn't let us through. So we just boshed it down the freeway for 15 miles. Now we've reached the point where bicycles can't be on the freeway anymore. Oh, babe, like 
your senses drive me wild Let's take this hard line We'll find it all right This falling chain You've been down too far Brave you So I just stopped at the petrol station to fill up on petrol On fill petrol? <laughs> yeah Now we've just stopped because uh, we need some water 40 miles to go, maybe less because we took a maybe a shortcut on the freeway. Do you mate? Petrol. I like how a can of Coke in the, U in the US is just one can. 200 calories. <laughs> <laughs> this is you man. That's a pile of flock. Good. Right, what is this place? <laughs> this is Nomad's Canteen, and this is where all of the pro surfers, when they have tours... Oh, we're pro surfers. They stay here, Easy. and they have the best food. How long do you reckon until we get back? A couple of hours. <laughs> yeah? Maybe. We've been out for about eight hours so far. It's 30 miles away. I say you would put Lozza on the front and tank it. <laughs> he can ride at 35 watts. miles an hour. <laughs> 300? <laughs> 400. Well, even like, like he doesn't even look like he's ridden his bike today. Chicken is this guy. <laughs> Fording. So what's up there? You haul up the street, about two miles. Look right, there'll be hundreds of them. Hundreds. Are you excited, mate? Oh my. God. You hauls. <laughs> With the dinosaurs and the pterodactyls. And all the things There's and dinosaurs. Is this the first puncher of the trip? It is. Yeah, unfortunately, it had to be me. Oh man. Yeah, they're brand new. Literally, this is like the second ride. Yes, no, first ride. Oh, I took it off on the wrong gear. Slide area. Where's the slide? I don't see any slides. I want to have a go on a slide. What's this douchebag doing? Oh, shit. Look, what? Where, where did you find that? It's uh, the adventure has took it, taken its toll already. Doping. Seven, 70 miles in. <laughs> He's doping. Doping? I never said doping. Yeah, American painkillers are like the shit. Oh, well, they're the good stuff. You're going to keep that with you to the end? I feel like um, <clears throat> I feel like that was a challenge. You said that like it was a challenge. L Loz is going to keep that flag with him right to the end. It's super lovely. Also, put this in my little um, uh, first aid kit. Fucking long fam. <laughs> and that is it. We made it to the 777 motor in. We're not on motors, but might as well be. That was 100 miles, pretty quick. That was six hours and 39 minutes. Rapid. How are you feeling? Oh, I feel, I feel right. I, um, I'm not going to be up until 12 doing an edit again, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm, pretty, I'm feeling pretty zonked, man. Yeah. That's I, the longest ride I've done in a long time. Yeah, I feel like we deserve a, a, like, a good meal and then a sleep. Really Catch nice. up. Big wave. Gangor buys us this. Yeah, she does. Yeah. From the pub in Kingston. Yeah, the pub in Kingston. Yeah, I you like should also beer. get it in LA. <laughs> it's my favourite beer, this. What, that exact one? Yeah. Cheers. This, this is my favourite beer. This is your second favourite Cheers. beer. Cheers, mate. Good work, boys. Nice Cheers. Work.